I've always loved everyday carry videos. It's really cool to see what people keep on their person and what they find important enough to carry with them every single day. So in this video, I'm gonna show you my everyday carry. These are the items that are always on my person. My name's Lane Sebring, this is my channel. I help entrepreneurs create passive income streams and self-publishing authors write and publish their books. I also do product reviews from time to time, so if you're into that kind of stuff, then definitely give this video a like and subscribe to this channel. So this is my everyday carry with a cool little caveat. All of these items can be purchased on Amazon and there will be a link down in the description below. So first up in my left front pocket is the iPhone. I have the iPhone 11 and I've had a lot of different versions of the iPhone. I first switched to the iPhone at iPhone 4 from a flip phone and I've actually never looked back. I just kept upgrading along the way. So you all know what an iPhone can do. I don't have to tell you about it, but I do wanna mention the case that I have. This is a Makeki clear back case that I really love. It shows the iPhone's back, which I like, and it also protects it from the sides. And it has these lips on the bottom of it that allow you to set it down flat on a surface without scratching the camera, which is really important to me. As I'm sure is the case with you, I use the camera all the time, so I definitely don't want to damage that. Next in my front right pocket is my wallet. I use the Rossum carbon fiber wallet. I love it. It's a card sleeve wallet, meaning that it basically only holds credit cards and your driver's license and your insurance card and things like that. I have found over the years that I don't need a big, thick, fat George Costanza wallet filled with receipts from 16 months ago when I had pizza. I really don't need to keep all that in my wallet at all times and neither do you. So I would highly recommend checking out the Rossum. I did a video all about it. I'm a huge fan of that wallet. In my front right pocket is my knife, which is the Kershaw Function EMT 8100. It's an EMT folding knife that has a lot of features. Not only does it have a three inch serrated stainless steel blade, it also has a carabiner clip, a cord cutter, a screwdriver tip, a hex wrench, and a glass breaking tip. I view my folding knife as less than something scary to walk around with and more of a tool. I find myself having uses for it all throughout the day like opening packages from Amazon. Next up are the Raycon E55s. Now these are an alternative to the Apple AirPods. And a lot of people ask me, how do they compare? Well, I have never actually owned Apple AirPods, so I can't speak to those. But the one thing that I love about the Raycons, at least this particular Raycon, is the fit and feel of the actual earbud. It goes in my ear and it fits really well. I'll do a whole video just on the Raycons, but if you're looking for an alternative to the Apple AirPods that are about half the price, I definitely recommend checking these out because I've been very happy with them. I'm a firm believer that my left wrist looks so much better with a watch on it. This is why I have the Apple Watch. Mine is an older one, it's Series 2, but it works perfectly for me and I don't really need to update it. I use this mostly for the fitness tracking. I use an app called FitBod, which tracks my workouts and then it syncs up to Apple Health so I can keep track of the calories that I use every single day. When I first thought about getting an Apple Watch, to be honest, I thought, that's ridiculous. Why do you need a phone in your pocket and a watch on your wrist that essentially do the exact same things? But I have found that the uses that the watch provides have been very convenient for me and I enjoy having it and I enjoy the way that it looks. Last up is my key fob and my north wall key organizer. I gotta tell you, I hate having keys in my pockets. So when I discovered the north wall key organizer, which basically puts all your keys into one little tight package and then wraps around it with a little band of leather, it was a game changer for me. So not only does it move my keys out of the way and keep them from ringing around, but it also has a neat little bottle opener and flathead screwdriver that comes in handy in a lot of different situations. So that's my minimalist EDC, but I would love to know what do you have in your pockets every single day? If you're new to this channel, one of the things that I love to do is help people make passive income online in a lot of different ways. So if that's something you're interested in, you can go to lanesebring.com slash super simple and pick up my super simple guide to your first $500 online. I'll show you step by step how I was able to turn a side hustle, side hobby into a full-time business. 
I'd love to put that in your hands and be sure to subscribe to this channel, give this video a like, and I'll see you in the next video.